The most beautiful of all wolves, probably, is the Arctic wolf, dazzles with its white coat and penetrating eyes. Arctic wolves are usually smaller than grey wolves and also have smaller ears, slightly shorter muzzles and shorter legs to reduce exposure to the frigid air. They live alone or in packs of about six wolves and are usually all white with a very thick insulating coat. Fortunately, the Arctic wolf is the least threatened of all the grey wolf and subspecies populations because of the isolation they live in that prevents them from being into contact with humans. The Hudson Bay wolf is a subspecies of grey wolf. They usually have a light grey and yellowish to creamy white coloration. Their hair gets lighter in the winter. Hudson Bay wolves have medium-sized bodies, measuring from 28 to 36 inches high. Their weight varies from 80 to 140 pounds. The females are usually smaller than males. This wolf is mesmerizing to look. They give out a very powerful energy. The Mackenzie Valley Wolf is an endangered grey wolf subspecies. The coat's colors varies and may be one or a combination of grey-black, white, cream or yellow-white shades. The Mackenzie Valley Wolf has powerful long legs that help increase their average mileage cover, even in deep snow and other tough terrains like rough rocky mountainsides and pathways. The Mackenzie Valley Wolf also has powerful muscles in the neck region, giving it a very stern look. The Labrador wolf is a subspecies of the grey wolf, primarily found in Labrador and northern Quebec. The species generally weighs around 30 kilograms, approximate to the average weight of most wolf species. Its coat is described as a pale light grey, tending toward white, though it can also be a dark grizzly grey. The Labrador wolf's dark look makes it look like a hard to tame type of dog. It brings back memories of the wolves in the Twilight movies. The distinct Alexander Archipelago wolves roam the islands and coastal mainlands in the Alexander Archipelago, a network of more than 1,000 islands, glaciated peaks, and deep river valleys in remote southeast Alaska. They are notably smaller and darker than the typical grey wolf, with a denser coat. On average, individuals weigh between 30 to 50 pounds, are 3.5 feet long, and stand around 2 feet high. They typically have a black or very dark grey coat. Their dark colour gives them a very elegant and mysterious look. Still need to see more beautiful animals? Check out the link to our playlist in the description below. See you in our next video!